compounding the problem for the Phoenix Suns. They've had no practice except for a couple of walkthroughs. Their bench is different, different starting lineup. Kobe is there. I mean, it seems like a lot is being piled on the Suns right now. Well, just when you think you're getting a handle on this Laker team, you, you outplay them in game four, you let a game slip away, you beat them in game five. Now you've got to try to adjust on the fly to a new starting lineup on the road in a closeout game. Let's see what Phoenix can do here tonight. You know, the Lakers are probably going to look early to go into the post. They've been doing it all series long. And Sean Marion, who has put together a string of very good second halves. It's the first half, which is a concern to the Suns. Well, they're going to need him for 48 minutes tonight. He cannot have a subpar, a subpar first half. And Kobe Bryant. So that's the difference right there. He can overpower Leandro Barbosa. Takes it right at the rim and shoots the little easy shot right around the basket. Nash inside for Diaw, coming off what was almost a triple-double on Tuesday. He's been brilliant the last two games. Of any guy who has really elevated his play for the Phoenix Suns, it's been Boris Diaw. Look at Nash. He floats in, and just like that, the Phoenix Suns have a lead of four. And Smush Parker, who's had shooting woes of late, picked up by Diaw. And it's a Nash three, and the three-point shooting tonight, huge for the Phoenix Suns. They have to win it by double digits. They're three of three. Here's Nash, who's got five. And four assists. Into Parker and by Parker. And into Brown, who gave very little resistance. You know how good that was. Kobe, three points to change. That's that triangle offense when the corner gets caught peeking at the post. You're taught to cut baseline. Kobe Bryant at the buzzer. Oh, between the eyes. Nash knocks in the little jumper. The Suns had two rebounds in that first oh. quarter. Two, two defensive rebounds because the Lakers only missed six shots and they had four offensive rebounds. There was only two rebounds to get on the defensive end. They had no offensive rebound. Kobe Bryant hey. and the three defending Suns players. No shot blocking at the basket. Kobe knows it. Kobe. Kobe Bryant over Barbosa. You see all the shots are taken. Now that's a tough shot. But the Lakers are getting nothing inside right now. I don't think the Lakers will beat them with jump shots. I think they're going to have to beat them big in the paint. Nash. Diaw left open. One no concerned about Nash down low. Sean Marion has got to stay away from his fourth foul if you're Phoenix. Kobe's got 18, now 20. And he is 9 of 14. Well, he's going to have to stabilize him. He's in that favor area. This is now called a pinch post, and he's got that shot down to the science. They may have to move Marion back on him. More size. Well, more Tim, bulk. Now, Tim Thomas is going to come into the game. If that's the case, they'll change the matchup. Steve Nash, little defense offered by Kwame Brown. Well, see, he's got to give him room because he doesn't want him to go all the way around him, and Nash is smart enough to know you just get to your area, pull up and shoot the basketball. Nash, and a three by Sean Marion. Remember, his second halves have been his best halves of this series. Remember I talked about that little fan pass on the baseline? That's what teams work on now. Kobe for three. But Bryant is on some kind of streak right now. Wait. Just 25 points. Here's Barbosa at the other end. Kobe, 25 in 29 minutes. Nash. I think he's done a few ball handling drills <laughs> in his lifetime. <laughs> I'm telling you, he is so smooth. He, just, he knows he's got Kwame on him in the switch. He just takes his time, pulls up and shoots the shot. Kujicic is on Nash. Odom now stands in front. How Nash got that inside to Marion, I do not know. But Sean Marion converts. Nash has his ninth assist. Marion got to be very careful here playing Kobe to stay away from the foul. He's right. He's got to rotate on that baseline. Slow getting there. 7 0 Laker run. Ujicic on Nash. Jones is open. Odom was sucked in by Nash's move. How do you find him? But see, you know, you know the guy is there because you practice a degree of difficulty. Switches hands, throws it right down the sideline. He knows exactly where his teammate is. Remember, he made a left-hand hook pass uh, to Sean Marion earlier in the quarter who hit a three. It's time winding down to the third. Nash fouled. Count it. He is some player. Six of six, Nash from the line. His dad was a pro soccer player in Johannesburg. His brother is a pro soccer player in Canada. Steve, who played a lot of soccer growing up, of course. The MVP, the reigning MVP in the NBA, and maybe winging it again this year. Nash has 10 assists over Brown. Nash from the floor tonight, 
has shot over 70 percent, eight of 11. Marion was successful earlier in the game when he had his gun against Kobe. Look at Bryant, tapped in, I think, by Kobe Bryant on his own miss. Dial the screen, Nash into Brown. <laughs> he didn't even hit the rim. It just barely ripples the net. See, they're switching all those screen rolls. Nash knows that, so he's going to get Kwame Brown involved in many pick and rolls as he can. Steve Nash, backed away by Parker, who picks up the foul for the Los Angeles Lakers. Marion is on Kobe Bryant, who has gone 13 of 25 tonight. Shot clock is down to five. Kobe. What a shot by Kobe Bryant! It's a two! And the Lakers on top by one. No, it's a three! Shot clock at 12. Marion is on Kobe Bryant. Kobe. Suns have not hit anything from the field in the last three minutes. They need a three to tie. Nash. Lost it. Got it. Barbosa and Nash for the tie. Marion the rebound. Tim Thomas with the fake for the tie. 6.3 to play in regulation. And looking at the clock. Is this the dagger? Oh, overtime. 105-105. Marion puts it inside. It's picked up by Lamar Odom. And the Los Angeles Clippers are wondering who they're going to play and when they're going to play. Kobe Bryant. And Kobe is put in 38. Shot clock again goes down to deep single digits at two. Kobe. Come on. Oh, oh wait. Oh, I mean, you can't guard that. I mean, he pumped fake twice, spun him back the other way. Sean Marion. That's been a play they have perfected throughout the regular season, although it has not been that much of a weapon in this series against the Los Angeles Lakers. Now the Lakers have scouted, scouted it well. Gone to Dion a lot. He then finds Thomas who launches a three. Good! Right in front of the Laker bench and a surprised Phil Jackson. Huge shot. Remember he hit the three to tie it. Now seven point lead. The Suns cannot relax. Nor can Kobe. He's amazing with the left hand there. Odom is on Nash. And off to Marion from Steve Nash, who picks up his 13th assist tonight. There's Bryant, who has taken 32. That's his 33rd shot tonight. That's a three. Kobe for three. Oh, my goodness. Banking it in. I mean, this, this is far from over, Kevin. It's a five-point game now. Kobe's remember got the, 50 points. Remember, the Suns lost a five-point lead. Lamar Odom. Nash with the rebound. We've got a game seven coming up in Phoenix. It'll be on Saturday night. It'll be on TNT. And Phoenix was down three games to one. And they have now tied the series.